Hi Capricorn, this is your channel messages for the 10th of the 10th, the 10, 10, October the 10th. I am your host, Vanessa Carby, psychic medium, spiritual practitioner, and tarot reader. Okay, so Capricorn, oh my fucking God, nobody introduced me to you properly. Maybe I saw you and you told me a name, but apparently Capricorn, that was not your name, Capricorn. They're trying to ask requests and send for Barack Obama's birth paper to see his true identity. Nobody told us what Satan's real name was. Listen, ISIS, if you come to New York, Obama gonna fuck all of you up, okay? I'm from New York. They killed Biggie. All right, so yeah, so yeah, you guys are requesting fucking Barack, Ob the honorable Barack Obama's birth paper, but you guys didn't show us the birth paper of Satan. So Capricorn, or should I say Pan, it is nice to reintroduce myself to you and it's nice to meet you. So upon doing a little research, I came across information that um, the devil is really not who we thought it was. No, I'm not going to try to convince this church behind me. That the devil is not who they say it are, okay? I will leave them to convince you to give the tie-ins at the end of the week, okay? But what I will do is share the information because we talk about occultic things here, mysticism, and a lot more, okay? So, apparently Pan was a nature deity. He was celebrated and feared. He had horn-shaped horns. Um, however, when... I'm not sure if it was like the, the whole, it was a whole period of paganism being cancelled and more modern doctrines being implemented. When that happened, um, the horn-shaped, um, um, the horn-shaped nature deity, which would be Capricorn, right? Because Capricorn is, Tar Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorns are earth signs, and all of them rule nature. So the horn-shaped image that was known as pan started to so the first propaganda misconception or basically the church is the one who actually changed him name you know like what them said christ was black christ not white but the church you change him white okay um satan never looked that way either satan was more arty he was more naturey. He had horns, but he looked more like Capricorn. Capricorn don't um Sagittarius. Sagittarius must seem that scary compared to how Capricorn looks. Both of them are half animal. Right? So Pan. So apparently this figure was re basically renamed and given a new identity when, when paganism wanted to be depleted back in the days. And the church end up started to, what the church started to do, they start telling their members that this is not a deity, this is an evil spirit that invokes pain, torture, and, and, and sickness, right? Then they started to have a lot of Christian illustrators redraw the, of what Capricorn was. And it was, back in that day, it was vital that these drawings would be seen by the masses. And it had to be a drawing where it looked both evil, um, it looked scary, and it looked like somebody you would not get close to. Thus, the devil was born. That is not how the, the Satan looks. Satan looked like, Satan, which is Pan, he don't look like this. He might have trees on him. He might have flowers growing out of him. So, the paganism and the propaganda that the church started because of Satan, they, he, he, he was no longer known as Pan. He was known as Satan now. Right? And he was um, deemed to be not a deity, but a devil figure embodying chaos and sin. So he was now used to be the one that if you deal with him, you know that you are part of chaos, sin, like a fucking um, um, Tasmanian and devil. But the church also wanted to use him as somebody who would instill fear in Christians when they did not obey God. So you got the image of this person. You add filters to the image and you tell the public to stay away from this horning creature because it only knows about chaos and sin. And then after you took a 
star, you take a star, you take a deity, the morning star, you take somebody who was in history before you were born, and now you change them image, change them face, and tell everybody around them, say, this person is now the devil, and they will hurt you, and they will harm you, and you have to stay away from them, and anybody who's caught talking to them, him, or talking about him, they will be punished, probably burnt, right? But at the same time, the, 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 the trick, you see, we can talk about NATO, Nobody know about blood clot trickster is him than the blood clot church. I am not even going to call the Pope and Vatican name right now because they're higher. Nobody know about tricking people and the blood clot church. So when they saw that this image was damn it working too well, they had to recreate it again and reinstill the fear of if you don't listen to God, he will come for you. Because he was there already. He was existing, he was a deity. People feared him a lot. Because him did, you know, him have horns, but it wasn't this evil, chaotic person. The church told people this. And then after the church told people this and saw that people were really scared of the devil, now them had to use the devil for control. The masses, by saying, and, and that's the weird thing. We can always talk about people saying that they don't believe in God. You should be very worried when somebody said they don't believe in the devil. Can God not punish nobody? Or do he, right? And if God punishes people by the wrath of God, then why are we blaming punishment on the devil? So there's something, there's something kind of off here. One side of the scale don't weigh the same as the other. So what do you want the devil for though? You want to use him for torment people? Or you want people to stay away from him? Because I'm getting no matter what you do, you cannot finish that Bible without mentioning this person's name. And it's for a reason that you may or may not comprehend right now. You see, also in the... Yeah, Satan was initially a more abstract concept within the Jewish community. The Jews, <laughs> the Jews that likes to call people Hitler, <laughs> that likes to call people lady in red. Sweetie, if a Jewish person call you lady in red, it ought to mean that you want to fuck your arm or to boil your blood. So be very wary as a Jewish woman or man going around evoking these type of lingos. Great. So Satan was initially a more abstract concept within the Jewish community, seen as, a up, seen as an obstacle or an opponent. The Jewish people never see Satan as somebody, if you don't listen to God, you're going to get burned in hell. They saw it as an abstract concept. You have, you have an obstacle in evil, face and devil. Even in the terror, that's what the devil means. The devil is facing your fears, facing all obstacles. That's what the devil is, is your fears in life. Because everybody at one point in their life, they must have got through the fear of of addictions catching up to them or of bad decisions happening that's what the devil is the devil is a the devil is really a abstract thought of um lower vibrational things in our life it's not necessarily real so the jews never believe in the devil as somebody who oversaw hell and punishing those who um did not listen to god they saw him as this is the oh you have an obstacle this is how it would look so your obstacle is for cut, cut the chain. Break every chain, break every chain, break every chain, right? So in other religions, they didn't even see the devil as a, a personification of somebody. So I'm just saying, Capricorn, somebody might have known you to be something for a long time. Maybe the public was brainwashed. Because the devil was an easy, he, I'm getting, Pan was an easy target because he had horns. It was so easy. It was all easy to convince people of the evil hatred person he was. He had horns. He was an easy target for the church. Nevertheless, Capricorn, I just want to say that I'm glad that I re-met you, Pan. Let's go ahead and go into your reading. So I do know that there was a story that was said that Hitler would have reincarnated again and he would have come back again. We weren't sure if he would have come back as a man or a woman, but we're getting him was going to come back again and we're getting, we're getting the fight with the Jews. They're going to fight the Jews in this lifetime. Now I don't know if that means you're literally going to go war, go fight them or we're getting a part. I'm getting like the white name, Jericho, the wall of Jericho, something go, go saw. 
Sup, boy, Jerry Cloth. Jerry Crow. Jerry Crow. Jacronium. There we fucking go. You walking around telling people I'm fucking crazy. I knew I wasn't fucking crazy. Jacronium. Jerry Crow. Me getting something about the wall at Jericho. Learn how the Israelites conquered Jericho by following God's instructions and trusting his powers. Me getting something about you have a back on the blood clot Jews. Or me getting, me getting something about one big blood clot secret the Jewish people in my hide. Me getting you have to expose it. Me getting you have to battle the Jews in this lifetime. And I would not wish that on anybody. I wouldn't wish, I, I, would, I would wish single motherhood on you. I would wish homeless on you. <laughs> the food is not bad here at all. Like, I must say, Thanksgiving dinner at tomorrow. I can't wait for them, right? Um, yeah, me getting you know, back to the Jews them. Something I go on with you and some Jewish people or you and some Jews. And me getting it very, me getting it a conglory or not. Me getting it deeper than you think. Me getting the battle of Jericho or the wall of Jericho, something about Jericho. The book of Joshua, when the Israelites were in captive at Shittim opposite Jericho, ready to cross the river of Joshua, as a final preparation, sent out two spies to Jericho. These spies stayed in the house of Rahab, a local prostitute. The king of Jericho sent soldiers who asked Rahab to bring out the spies. Instead, she hid them under a bundle of flax on the floor. After escaping, the spies promised to spare Rahab of her family after taking the city. Something is way more intricate than you know. There's something about a Jewish sector, something about a spy who was sent in, something about a prostitute or somebody posing as a prostitute. Thus, the lady in red. I'm getting the battle of Jericho. Before you call somebody lady in red, make sure you're not trying to fuck them or boil them bloody. You hear me tell you? There's something about a spy or about you hiding, covering for two Jewish spy. Let's go ahead and go into your reading. We have the Empress coming out first. Now we're talking about Pan, but there's also Lilith, or Lucy. We're getting Taurus, um, Taurus Libra coming out first in your reading. So we have a Taurus and Libra. We have FBI, yeah. I did not show this for the other readings. I'm so sorry. Oh, it's not going to work. We need to find a new setup. We need to buy a tripod. We have, we have the Empress and FBI. There we go. So I'm getting your more, I'm getting your warm, I'm getting your more influence, influential in something than you think. I'm getting your back of some blood, I'm getting your job here in this earth. I don't know what you said, I don't know why you decided to join the line at that time. I'm getting your back of the Jews that you're here. I'm getting, this is going to be on the fucking map. I'm getting Empress FBI. Taurus, Libra and the FBI. We have killed them with kindness. This could also be something about argon harvesting. I'm getting something about some Jewish people and argon harvesting. We have a star card, yeah. Because I'm getting Selena Gomez for some reason. Is Benny Jewish? That guy, is he a Jew? Is he Jewish? Selena Gomez's boyfriend. Is he Jewish? Blanco, Blanco don't seem Jewish. May I get Selena Gomez, or may I get something about your, your argon get taken away by some Jewish people? Like your kidney or your liver? Am I getting something like that? So Selena boyfriend born the same day as my mother. Okay, never mind Selena. You can't deal with him. I don't even care about him bird chart right now. I'm joking. Okay, let me look. I have to look actually. I'm trying to see where he come from. He is American. He does not look up. He is Jewish. Man, I know a Jew when I see one. You can't tell me not, man. Sweetie, let me tell I know a Jewish when I see one. I know a Jew when I see one, man. Sweetie, you can't hide from me. 
No, no, they can't hide from me. <laughs> the Vlocky said, me and the police for pointing it out. He is Jewish. Benny Blanco was born Benjamin Joseph Levy in Reston, Virginia, and he has an older brother. He is Jewish. Me know, he look Jewish. So I'm getting something out, you want to Jews, then I'm going back home. Get it now? Or do you still think I need to be medicated? <laughs> so fucking shit, underrated. And we got Gemini. Is he a Gemini? No, he's a Pisces. He's born March the 8th. Love the guy though. March the 8th, great. He's born March the 8th, 1988. Okay. You're born 1988 and you're a Jewish man. Not saying that that's not possible. I'm just saying, bruh, we're not even going to read the bird shot there right now. Let us go ahead and continue. Let's clarify to see what the fuck is up. <laughs> The Empress is a two of pentacles. So I'm going, I'm getting you're going back and forth on this decision. Are you supposed to join the FBI or are you going back and forth as to if you should give this information to somebody? We have a judgment card. I'm getting you're going to give them or I'm getting the, the FBI has found a missing piece of the puzzle that has to do, deal with you. That I'm getting something significant to help them to understand a situation at face value. So it's either you're gonna make a decision for work with them or you're gonna make a decision for talk to them. I'm getting there's something the FBI know about you. Or you and somebody else. Kill them with kindness is the eight of cups. The star card is the king of no, the knight of cups. Underrated is the chariot, that's the police, and Gemini is this, yeah, I'm getting okay. So Gemini's opposite is Sagittarius. So I'm getting a Gemini is I'm getting something with a Gemini Jewish man. And if the man a Gemini, me getting something about that Gemini man here. Like him, him a protect you I don't know if someone's a cancer Gemini. Or me getting a Gemini police officer. Now, me don't know if the man, yeah, battle. If me don't know if the man who you're supposed to be having this spiritual warfare with me don't know if him work for special forces or work for military or work for the police because i'm getting your enemies in the force are your enemy have ties to the force no I, I don't feel like i feel like the person has the power to give out orders and these orders be executed but i'm getting nobody's actually questioning actually why are we doing this again like you're not asked a question you're just a follow orders Now, this could also be something about a Sagittarius police officer. Me getting you know one Jewish boy, one Jewish man, him a one Sagittarius and became a police officer now. Now I feel like this person may have left an organization and you were blamed for it. Cause me getting when me getting, if you if you would leave, me getting after you leave, a couple of months later, somebody else left. And I'm getting the organization took a hit. Or whatever this is, the record label took a hit. And me getting somebody have a ranking, them have money, but them, 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 no, me getting somebody have money, them have a name, but them don't have the ranking. Me getting something about your lockout, one empress, me getting one police officer, I get lockout too. I was also getting something last night that was so fucking weird. Me getting someone Islamic. Me getting, so me getting, me getting something about one white man who decides to convert to Islam. He never decided for a blood clot Muslim. He didn't decide to be a fucking Muslim like Nick Cannon. He decided to go. Say, him, him claims say, he is claiming that he's a, him Islamic. Me getting that man in a blood clot Islamic. And sir, with your blood clot white skin color, me no blood clot no why not take up yourself as jump over Christianity, jump past Jews, gone past blood clot Muslim will take every blood clot body, right? Muslim is non discriminative more than blood clot Christianity, right? And you're gone jump say Islamic, sir, you don't know who you're playing with? That is one of the most feared religions. Islam. I'm afraid of Islam people more than I'm afraid of Jewish people. And I know that to Jews that would not be a compliment. I'm getting one white. I don't know if you're in the church. Or I'm getting one pastor man. But him white. I'm getting him just convert. He wasn't Islamic. He just convert. And as he convert him gone to the church. You better run out that blood clot demon. You hear? And I feel like 
the, the, the energy this person carry, you're gonna know specifically who me I talk about. One white Islamic man, him claims him Islamic, I'm claiming in a church, or he wants to be somebody who is talking to your church members. Run out the blood clot demon out of your fucking church. And I have no connection to Islam. Me not have none. Me don't know one per Islamic person. Me don't know nobody Islamic. But me, me getting that dream last night one white Islamic man. Me don't know if that man have tattoos on him. Me getting somebody who repent and decided to change their religion. Me getting them chose Islam first. Me don't know if them chose it because of the wife thing. And me getting that man you love beat them wife and them know the Islamic woman them. Me getting somebody do fuckery in them lifetime and them know that if them convert, they would be automatically granted power. Like if you are one, for example, you are a white man and you're used to traffic and rape and all kind of things, me getting a convert to Islam and me getting you know say, as a man in Islam, no woman now gonna question you. So, so you can get the abuse them to your liking. Me getting some of this man will come on the building and him very friendly, very nice, helping out, helping the young, 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 young girls them, right? Me getting in for running him out. And I'm also getting this, this, this situation between you and this police officer and this Sagittarius police officer. Me getting somebody either want you join something, but me getting you have a name for yourself out there already. But somebody when you join something again. I'm getting somebody, maybe somebody wanted to use your face to represent their group. But me getting, I don't know, the FBI look into something. Me getting the FBI look into your identity. Or them are looking to where you come from. I'm going to leave it here. Until next time, bye.